What's up folks? Back with another reaction, back with some more hardcore, and indeed we're back with some more old school hardcore on the Roughneck label. Um, if you go look at my old channel, I did a reaction to one of the tunes on this record before. It's by Depredator. Uh, the Depredator, I think it's Steve Sheltema. Um, I believe that is a, uh, he's a Dutch artist. He's been around, obviously, since the old school days. This record's from 97. Um, this record is called Dub Plate Style. Member of the Roughneck Alliance, uh, recorded at The Tower. Uh, this, Roughneck's, uh, Roughneck 46-5. I was looking for the cat number. Uh, but yeah, this is Art Attack uh, by Dub Predator on the Dub Plate Style release, 1997 Roughneck Records. Let's get right to it. Uh, here we go, Art Attack. Let's start that on the correct speed. When it comes, it's coming like a blood clot, art attack. Blood clot, art attack. channel that um, dissonance is a funny thing like it doesn't always hit my brain right it depends on the particular dissonance uh, dissonance whether it's the you know the synth itself or like the particular you know like melodic line that the synth does or whatever it is um, so you know it depends like dissonance can be a great thing in a tune though it can in some cases like drag a tune down um, if my brain doesn't really take it right uh, but this is great this is perfect it just really has that like wicked like mental like lunatic asylum quality um but it, again it just hits my brain in a way that it enjoys the dissonance rather than being like repulsed by it That's a complete dead pause of the last four. I love that. Sort of like leaves you hanging for a moment and then drops you back in. Ugh. The, the acid layer, the sort of acid pulse, is great. By the way, drum and bass rhythms doing their part for the hardcore style. Spit out! <laughs> 
be missing is a just quick like reprise of that really like tension filled dissonant synth um, but even without it I, again I love the sort of acid pulse and the right out and the again sort of simple rhythm or not simple but um, relatively basic rhythm compared to other parts of the tune of the the drum and bass um, percussions uh, the acid pulse and the kick bass uh, combination is really great um, like I said I like all three tracks on that record I've now reacted to two of them one on my old channel one on this one I'll eventually get around to the third one as I said I'm just gonna try to keep looking forward I know I keep mentioning the old channel but it's only because like when I make some of these references oh I've talked about it in a number of videos and people will be like there's like 15 videos in your channel and I don't think you talked about that in any of them I just need to make sure that like yeah there's like 450 in the old one and you know a lot of those I did mention some of these things like about dissonance or like about hearing a tune at first then sort of the second phase and then a third phase where you totally understand it these things I have talked about a lot just most of them are on my old channel which basically looks identical it has the same banner the same you know I try to make it as, as identical as possible maybe that's not smart maybe I should have like made it different so it's clear that there is two channels but you know I just want the same branding that I had before so again hopefully this channel eventually starts to pick up some interest um, if you are watching this um, you know feel free to share it with some people especially you know if there are people who had uh, interacted with old videos of mine and may not be aware that I had to start a new channel so yeah like I said just looking for a little help from my acid brothers and sisters hopefully you can do that even if you can't I do appreciate you coming and watching uh, feel free to request a track or just you know give me some feedback or suggestions I'd love to hear it other than that have a good day have a good night I'll see you next time peace